Today I'm going to tell you about something that is going to help you when you reformat your computer or reinstall a hard drive. Something you need to do along not with just backup in the your documents and pictures and music files and what have you. Driver files are just as important as document files. You need driver files for the screen to properly be displayed or your speakers or Wi-Fi whatnot. So there's a couple of programs out there for you to extract it or to back up the driver file. So if you wanted to do a full blowout of your hard drive, format it, put an operating system on it so you have just a bare bone Windows installation and not whatever the company laptop you bought stuff on there, you want to also make sure you have the drivers already in, on a disk so you can install it fairly quickly. This program is called Double Driver. And when you download it, this is a completely freeware. It's a pretty neat little program. It's for XP Vista 7. They have versions out there of the driver extractors or whatever for Windows 8. But I'm not covering Windows 8 yet. I haven't got there yet. But we're just going to do this here. So you double click on the double D. Tell it run. And it's going to pop this up. So you got backup, restore. And this program, for what I understand, can also be used as a portable device. So that means you can take and put this on a jump drive or whatever, is what I'm guessing. And you can tell it to back up, or you can tell it to restore, and it's going to restore your drivers. So right now I'm going to tell it back up. And I'm going to scan the current system. So, you have probably a lot of different things that you can do. You can select whatever you want. Uh, I'm not really caring for the Apple thing, but I'll leave it as is. CD-ROM is just basic. The graphics you need. Audio, of course. Touchpad. The wireless in. The driver for the printer is on there. PCI bus. So you can all you can all this stuff here you can take and click and you if you want it all you can put it all on there. So it's got the Bluetooth and all that. So you can tell it back up now once you're happy with the selection. And you can put it in the structure folder, single file, self extract, executable, compress and zip folder. I'm going to do just the default. Let's see what happens. Because this is going to be cool if you can take and copy all your files, your drivers, and put it on a single disk. And then when you format your hard drive, you have all your drivers right then and there. You can install it and be done within 10, 15 minutes rather than going online, going to the company's website and looking for the drivers and doing this and if you don't have the disk anymore this is the software that you need to download double driver 4.1.0 I'll have a link 
since it's freeware I'll have a link in my Dropbox I'll put that in the video description so after this gets done processing all the files we'll see what the folder looks like Okay, operating completed successfully. Tell it okay. And let's see. I don't remember where it said it. Back the file up and we'll click on backup again. Okay, dump documents driver backup. Alright, so once you get done with that. You go to your documents, double driver backup, got the name and model of the laptop, and date that you did it, and it puts it in order, it's just pretty neat, PCI bus, all that is so cool. So. Here's the net thing. There's the wireless in. There's all the drivers I needed for that. So if this computer would ever crash and I needed to put a new hard drive in, install a, a new copy of Windows, I could put this on a USB drive or a CD-ROM, keep it per permanent. It's only his. I would probably have to put it on a DVD-ROM. And that's all you need to have. So hopefully that will help you out. This is something I suggest for everybody to do. If you have any questions or comments, leave it in the comment section below. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.